I'm Tim Wright and today I'm going to show you how to paint this T-Rex. Okay, so let's get started painting that T-Rex. So I'm going to start off with my four brushes. The first brush you're going to have is your largest brush. That's the fatty. The next brush you have is a little bit smaller, your medium brush. Skip a brush, you'll find your littlest brush. That's your baby. And then I have my brush that's in between, my baby and my medium, and I call that the tween. So I'm going to go ahead and start with the background. So let's go ahead and grab our fatty brush, tap a little water, and zhuzh the white. I'm going to push it, move it. I always like to grab the biggest chunk of white I possibly can, like so. And I'm going to grab a chunk of that light blue and just start painting. So I'm gonna go ahead and go around the T-Rex here. Kind of get in there as his little mouth. And don't worry about the arms because let's face it, they're so little that you're gonna paint over it anyway. And then I'm gonna go ahead and paint down here. I'm always tapping water, grabbing good paint on my brush. Back and forth, back and forth. I'm gonna have a volcano in the background, so let's go ahead and kind of go like that, tap a little water, always grabbing a little bit of white. I find that the more paint you use, kind of the better it is, so I'm grabbing tons of paint. We're gonna add some, obviously some plants as well, but let's just go ahead and get this in. My, both my boys are crazy into dinosaurs. I mean, my whole life is dinosaurs when I get home. Okay, do, do, do. So they're gonna appreciate this because they know mommy specializes in glitter, but today is all about for the boys. And girls love dinosaurs too. Okay, let's go ahead and wash it, wash it. Let's grab our medium brush, tap a little water, zhuzh the chocolate brown. I'm just gonna take that, look at how big that chunk of chocolate brown is. Let's go ahead and do all of our, our volcano over here. So this is the background. And notice that, like, honestly, I'm being able to paint this whole volcano in um, with only one dip of paint. And I'm actually gonna go under the table too, or under the tail, a little bit under here by his legs. So let's face it, I didn't need to put blue there, but whatever, you could just paint over it. No big deal. Just like that, la la la. Let's do the ground. While we have that brown on our brush, just grab a little bit of white, a little bit of that ugly mustard, and let's go ahead and just paint that in. Paint that in, just like so. And I might grab a little chocolate brown too, why not? A little ugly mustard, a little bit of white, just like so, just like so. Perfect, it's like, oh look, look, oh it's a mountain, that's crazy. You know, it doesn't have to be perfectly straight. Maybe add some more white to it, a little highlight, like that. Perfect. Washi, washi. So I'm washi, washi. Let's go straight into our T-Rex. And I'm going to, I'm gonna do his little tummy a different color. So I'm gonna do like a lime green. And I'll put his little tummy in right there, just like so just to kind of add like a little different color. Then I'm gonna, um, I'll just wipe off my brush. Shows a little bit dark green. I might corner a little white. Let's go ahead and go around. So this is where you're gonna get the kind of the shape of his head. So you could take a little bit more time. Like so. I'm always kind of moving my brush. Cause you know your brush goes two ways, fatty, skinny. So in my skinny position, I'm gonna kind of go right here because obviously the boys are gonna to wanna to see the teeth. So I gotta keep his mouth open like that, bringing it down. I mean, I never thought that I would know the difference between all the different dinosaurs from Pterodactyls, Stegosaurus, Spinosaurus, all the carnivores, Carnosaurus, you name it, Ankylosaurus. Let's see. I mean, I can go on and on and on. 
Mosasaurus. Let's get into the water dinosaurs. Okay, I mean, there's so many. Okay, so this is gonna kind of come down, la la la. And then let's do his leg. So I'm gonna grab a little corner white too, just so that way it has like a little highlight on there. So it comes down, there's his little feet. And then his back leg, maybe we'll put a little black in the back leg. So that way it's kind of like, oh, it's in the background. I'm gonna go back with my tween brush. Oh, I probably should add a little water to that. And then that way, kind of like that. Like so. You can take more of that lime green, just kind of smooth out little areas that you need to. Okay, so the T Rex has tiny little arms. And also, let's mention that um, the T Rex only has two claws. Um, my son is always like, oh, that's not a T-Rex. It has three claws. So let's make sure that we are very specific with our claws here. Let's face it, T-Rexes are not my specialty, but you know what, I am trying, okay? When you paint from the heart, it just makes it look that much better. That's what I like to tell myself. Okay, so. Here we go. I'm gonna make grab a little bit of black. Just kind of like, oh, here's this kind of like where his eye goes, his little nose socket here. Like so we'll put his, we'll put the eye in. We'll put the eye in right now. Okay. I'm gonna have a little highlight here. A little white. Let's highlight a cake. You know what? Mine's gonna have some stripes on it. Why not? You know, they don't truly know what the skin and the colors of the dinosaurs are. So like, yeah, mine's gonna be striped. I mean, I really wanna put a big bow on it, but it's not about me today. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and just grab my tween. I'm gonna flatten it out. I'm just gonna add just a little bit of red. Like so. And then I'm gonna grab my baby brush with some whites. Put those little teethers in there. Do, 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 do. Like, roar. I like to say, roar means I love you in my house. So, maybe that makes me feel better saying, well, I love you all the time when really my kids are just roaring like dinosaurs all the time. Okay, so let's put our little eye like that. Put a little black in there. Just like, might look a little goofy, but. He's happy. He's one of the nice ones. He's one of the nice, nice dinosaurs. Oh, maybe we'll put a little cheek. Give him some definition right here. Like so. Maybe take some of that black and add some more definition. You know, like, is that definition or does that he just look a little dirty from the ash of the volcano? Okay, let's go ahead and grab my medium brush. Let's get this volcano. So I'm gonna go ahead and zhuzh you the pretty yellow with some white. Got a little green on there. Let's go ahead and, and it's like, look how much paint is on there. I'm just kind of like frosting it like so, frosting it. And yes, I know that lava is not yellow, but this is just our base. Okay, this is just the base. Lava, oh, it's going off the page. Oh, it's going off the page. Okay, I'm gonna grab a little bit of red. Now we're talking. Now we're talking. Oh, lava. Oh, there's some lava down here. Why not? Oh, oh, watch out, T Rex. Don't get in the lava. Okay, washy washy. Now let's do some plants. Obviously, I want to do some green, but the T Rex is so green. So let's do, um, you know what? I'm going to add a little magenta. You know, like these are some like cool, kind of like prehistoric hot pink plants. We'll put some greenery in there. A little green, a little yellow. It's like here, like so. Maybe we're over here and we're like, oh, why not? Oh, he's about to go into the jungle. Watch out. He's about to go into the jungle, like so. It's like, oh, why not? We can add some green over here. You know, the volcanoes in the distance. 
volcanoes in the distance. So we can add a little bit down here. Do, 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 do. Okay, I need more color. I need more color. Do, do, do. Big plants, big plants. Just kind of painting and painting and painting. painting. Okay, two. Okay, so I'm gonna add some flowers. So, you mean even boys love a little flower. Whenever I put flowers in the house, my, my husband's always like, that looks nice. I'm like, yeah, because it does look nice when you add some color to things, you know? It's happy. And again, there's no rhyme or reason where these things are going. It's just to add some color to some things. You know what, maybe this is like a, maybe this is like a magenta palm frond here. Let's give it some shape. Why not? Why not? It comes down here, and it's like, oh, over here. Over here, we got some more magenta. Why not? And so see how the magenta is kind of dark? I can add a little white. Oh, highlight. Look how pretty that looks, you know? Looks pretty. If I was a T-Rex, I'd hang out here too. You know? Oh, look, it's behind the tail. That's crazy, you know? So honestly, I think this looks pretty good. If anything, I might add little dark shadows down here just to kind of like allow things to kind of pop. Again, I'm just grabbing some brown and black. La la la. And honestly, I think my boys are gonna love this for their room. So at the end, I usually write Tim Ray, but in this case, I'm gonna sign it mom. So mom, just like that. Whenever you make things for kids, I think it's sweet to write mom as your name. If you like this painting and want to see more dinosaur paintings like it, please subscribe and leave a comment below. If you have other ideas for boy paintings, let me know. Check out Timmy.com with everything I do.